Apache Spark is an open source cluster computing framework that was initially developed at UC Berkeley in the AMP Lab. As compared to the disk based two stage MapReduce of Hadoop, Spark provides up to 100 times faster performance for a few applications with in memory primitives. This makes it suitable for machine learning algorithms, as it allows programs to load data into the memory of a cluster and query the data constantly. As shown on the screen, a Spark project contains various components such as Spark Core and Resilient Distributed Datasets or RDDs, Spark SQL, Spark Streaming, Machine Learning Library or ML Library, and GraphX. Spark was started at UC Berkeley AMP Lab by Matei Zaharia in the year 2009. It was in 2010 when it was open sourced under a BSD license. The project was then donated to the Apache Software Foundation, and the license was changed to Apache 2.0 in the year 2013. In the month of February 2014, Spark became an Apache top-level project. Then in November of the same year, it was used by the engineering team at Databricks to set a world record in large-scale sorting. Now Databricks provides commercial support, and they provide certification for it. At present, Spark exists as a next-generation real-time and batch processing framework. The graphic on the screen also displays the journey of Spark. The components of a Spark project are listed on the screen. The first component is Spark Core and RDDs, which is the foundation of the entire project. It provides basic input-output functionalities, distributed task dispatching, and scheduling. RDDs is the basic programming abstraction and is a collection of data that is partitioned across machines logically. These can be created by applying coarse-grained transformations on the existing RDDs or by referencing external datasets. The examples of these transformations are reduce, join, filter, and map. The abstraction of RDDs is exposed similarly as in-process and local collections through a language-integrated API in Python, Java, and Scala. As a result, the complexity of programming is simplified, as the manner in which applications change RDDs is similar to changing local data collections. Spark SQL is a component lying on the top of Spark Core. It introduces Schema RDD, which is a new data abstraction and supports semi-structured and structured data. This abstraction can be manipulated in Java, Scala, and Python by the Spark SQL provided a domain-specific language. In addition, Spark SQL supports SQL with ODBC, JDBC server and command line interfaces. The next component, Spark Streaming, leverages the fast scheduling capability of Spark Core for streaming analytics, ingests data in small batches, and performs RDD transformations on them. With this design, the same application code set that is written for batch analytics can be used on a single engine for streaming analytics. Machine Learning Library lies on the top of Spark and is a distributed machine learning framework. With its memory-based architecture, it's nine times faster than the Apache Mahout's Hadoop disk-based version. In addition, the library performs even better than ValPalWabbit. In addition, it applies various common statistical and machine learning algorithms. The last component, GraphX, also lies on the top of Spark and is a distributed graph processing framework. For the computation of graphs, it provides an API and an optimized runtime for the Pregel abstraction. The API can also model this abstraction. Hey, want to become an expert in big data? Then subscribe to the Simply Learn channel and click here to watch more such videos. To nerd up and get certified in big data, click here.